my name is Steve Reinitz. I'm a third year PhD candidate here at Thayer in the Innovation Program. And I work with Professor Doug Van Sitters in the Orthopedic Biomaterials Laboratory. And we collaborate with uh, John Collier in the Dartmouth Biomedical Engineering Center. Professor Collier's lab is primarily uh, on the, the retrieval side of things, looking at prosthetic joints that failed and trying to understand why they failed, whereas Professor Van Sitters is focused more on developing new materials to try to improve joint replacements. And my thesis right now is on a process called equal channel angular extrusion. It's a new method of producing uh, ultra high molecular weight polyethylene, which is just the plastic that's used in joint replacements. So basically what we're trying to do is make better joint replacements, specifically uh, better knee replacements. And what we're doing is an alternative processing technique uh, where we're trying to make a, a more entangled material, which means that it has better wear resistance and better fracture toughness. So a stronger material and a more resilient material uh, that will hopefully last longer in patients because current joint replacements can last anywhere from 15 to 20 years. And we're always trying to improve that number. The most exciting thing about it is that we never really know what's going to happen with any given technique. So we're, we're really just exploring the science side of things right now. Um, uh, a previous student in the laboratory had done a basic proof of concept to show that the technique works. But at this point, we don't really know fully how it works and how best it works. And so really, every day, we're setting up new tests, changing parameters, and we don't know how it's going to turn out. So yeah, every day is a new discovery, which is really exciting.